using a matte black pencil. I'm just going to go over my lid up to the crease of the eye. We're going to tidy those edges up with some powder. So it doesn't have to be perfect. You're just trying to create a base so the powder can stick to something. Then I'm going to use a MAC 231 brush and a matte black eyeshadow and we're just going to go over the lines we created. So here you can just even out that edge making it more tidy. Here at the outer corner just go upwards a bit and inwards like a gigantic flick. And using your black pencil, we're just going to go underneath along the lower lash line. Just about halfway in. And we're just going to also color our waterline. Now using your MAC 231 brush, we're just going to go over the liner. And we're just going to go downwards a little kind of beak shape. Then using a flat brush I'm going to use this kind of a, a creamy white here. It's even better if you start with this process so then you don't get the white onto your black. And now we're ready for the lashes. I'm going to start by using this lash I bought at H&M. It's kind of a, a quite heavy lash but with a kind of a spiky effect and we're going to place some glue and we're just going to stick this lash down on the upper lash line. And next I'm going to use this super thick kind of feathered false lash over the top just on top of that one. And I'm going to use this small sort of spaced out lash for the bottom lash line and we're going to place some more glue. We're just going to stick this along the lower lash line brush, I'm just going to use a bit more of this iridescent white color. We're going to create a little highlight here just below the eye. That'll look trontastic. For the blush I'm going to use this product by Bourjois. It's a kind of iridescent pink with a kind of slightly gold shimmer. I'm just going to open it up. It comes with its own little brush. Onto an angled brush and we're just going to place just the slightest hint of an iridescent pink so that it doesn't really kind of make you look like you have pinky cheeks but you just want a little bit more highlight here. I started with a concealer and I just placed that all over my lips and then I went over with some lip gloss to make it glossy and then using a lip brush I used this color here it's a kind of an iridescent white by Creolin just make a little highlight above the cupid's bow and actually just outline your lips and then I placed a little bit just here in the center to give it a pop of 3D highlight 